Hello everyone, Silver Conundrum here. So I come to you today with another question. What would you choose? Painful knowledge or blissful ignorance? Red pill or blue pill? The day you decide that you want to get away from the fiat currency, the day you decide that you no longer want to be a part of a system that enslaves you, You have decided to take the red pill. The red pill will enlighten you to a point of pain. The pain of knowing that you have been bamboozled all the way up to the point you have decided to awaken yourself. You have decided to let your eyes be wide open. Why is that, you may ask? Well, that's because you have realized And you have come to the understanding that the fiat currency that we have been presented with is just that. It's fiat. It's fake. It doesn't exist. The only thing backing it is the faith of the government and its people. Every day we print off millions and trillions of extra paper dollars. And every time we print these dollars, we lose purchasing power. With silver and gold as being our new form of currency, our preferred method of money, we have actually started to prepare ourselves for what's to come. Don't be fooled by the naysayers. Don't let yourself be taken back by all the ridicule and all the the laughter by everybody. You are one of the few people who have decided to wake up. Remember, As long as people can keep pitting each other against one another, there will always be feuds. Those who are in power do everything they can to stop us. They say the white man hates the black man, the Jew hates the Muslim, the Muslim hates the Christian, and the Christian hates everybody. These are just fallacies, people. The point is, Politics is a thing that is there to divide us, to distract us from all the evil doing in the world. A man's race, color, creed, or religious beliefs has nothing to do with his feelings towards one another. As long as we have a common goal and an interest, nothing else should ever matter. When we look at one another and we realize our brother accepts us with open arms, for who we are and what we are, that is a big turning point in our evolution of understanding. A lot of you may disagree with what I've just said, and that's okay, as long as you understand it with an open mind. If you don't understand what I'm trying to say to you and your mind is closed, you may go ahead and just unsubscribe, leave dislike comments, and leave hate mail in in my personal mailbox which I am totally good with. If you don't want to allow yourself to think freely, then we have an issue at hand and it's much deeper than you understanding the value of what's going on around you. All of these multi-billionaires and these trillionaires and these politicians, all they keep doing is telling us that our currency is king. The dollar, the euro, the dong, the yen, all of it is king compared to all the fiat currencies. And as long as we keep believing that, our precious metals will never see the power that they so deserve. Gold and silver are God's money. And I don't care if you say God or whatever else, it is the people's money. Man has chosen naturally silver and gold as our currency. It has intrinsic value. We put in time, effort, sweat, blood, tears into getting it out of the ground, processing it, resourcing it out, minting it, and getting it where it goes. What do you do with a a printing press? Throw a few pieces of paper on it, print it out by the millions with a little bit of ink. There you go. You just created a trillion dollars. 
What about on a, on a computer? All it is a couple keystrokes and you made a trillion dollars. Congratulations. Zero effort, zero anything. Guys, wake up, allow yourselves to open your eyes and you have to choose for yourself. Nobody else can do it for you. Do you choose the red pill of painful knowledge and understanding? Or do you choose the blue pill of blissful ignorance? Because I can assure you, blissful ignorance is one of those things that, yes, it is just that. It is blissful. But the ignorance side of it comes with a steep cost. It comes with the cost of your freedom. It comes with the cost of your understanding. It comes with the cost of your children and their next part of their evolutional economic livelihoods. Do not allow yourself to be fooled by those in power. They will do everything they can to own everything that you have. It might not be today that they take it. It may be over the lifespan of your family's bloodline. They're doing everything they can every day to take what little bits you do have. They're shifting the monetary powers over. If you don't believe that, look at what's going on in the United States right now. Look how long it took them to pass the stimulus checks the first go around. Look how long it's taken them to pass the second stimulus checks. Look how many people they put out of work all over a virus. People, open your eyes, wake up, and realize what's going on around you. Our country is slowly manipulating its way into your wallets, and it's being obvious and blatant about it. There are people who are talking about this on many channels. There are people out there who are trying to waken your mind. Do not be fooled by those that are trying to get something from you for nothing. There are channels out there, people, that want you to do nothing but consume. They want you to consume the bull crap. Why? Because they're making money off of you no differently than anybody else. I have a list down in my descriptions of people that I highly recommend. These people are the ones that I cherish. They have your best interests at heart. I have watched their channels from the very day they started to where they are at now. You have people out there like Ana T. You have people out there like AG Skyflyer, X Pack Stacker, Silver Game of Thrones. You have people out there like Golden Gun. I mean, the list goes on, people. If you want to check these guys out, they're in my descriptions below. Just click on the link and take you straight to their homepage. All you have to do is open your mind, folks. Please like, share, and subscribe. Sorry. Please like, share, and subscribe. And if you have anything you want to talk about, leave it in the descriptions below. Anyways, I'll catch you guys later. See y'all in the next one.